how to share a document with others even if they're not logged in. They can still see it and if they're logged into Google Docs, they can comment on it. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to quickly create a Google document by doing voc.new. You could do this as well. That creates a brand new private Google document that resides in your Google Drive folder. I'm just going to start with a test document. That's the title of this and I'm going to just say this is a very important document. Next, I'm going to go ahead and share it so that anyone with the link can view it. And then I'll show, I'll show you how to share it so that people who are logged in can comment if you want them to do so. So uh, on the top right, you see that there's this button that says private only to me. I'm gonna click on that, go ahead and do that with, with yours document as well. And you could see that right now only I have access, I'm the owner as well, and general access is restricted. So here's where you want to click on restricted and select anyone with the link. And now anyone with the link that you give them will copy the link soon, will be able to view the document, even if they're not logged in to Google, they can view it. But if you want them to be able to comment on it, to add comments, not change the whole document, but just to add their suggestions, which you can reject if you want to, you can click on where it says viewer and click on commenter. And then now if you click copy link, uh, and I'm going to click done and then you go to like, let's say an email. And if you, if you, um, let's see, hello, this is the document. Um, if they go there, they will be able to comment on it. Uh, again, you can always change the, the privacy back if you just want them to be able to view and not be able to comment on it. And if you do that, you don't even have to reshare the link. It's the same link. When they, re when they try to comment on it going forward, they won't be able to. So it's up to you whether you want to do that or not. I hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching. If you have any other uh, tips for others with Google Docs, feel free to comment below.